Hey, my beautiful, powerful Scorpios. Welcome to Scorpio Intuitions. Everybody like and subscribe. Remember, this is a potluck. I bring the messages. You bring the likes and the subscribes and the comments, all right? Most high, thank you for my beautiful, powerful, sexy ass collective. I thank you for my Scorpio's life. I thank you for the joy that they are walking into. Victory is our portion. We walk in it. We receive it. It is so. All right, so what do we need to know most high? What is it that we need to know? Now, guys, I'm going through random cards, just picking out stuff. Because ain't no point of having all these cards and not getting these messages, right? <laughs> all right, most high, what is it I collectively should know? And what is this deck? I think this is like past life. Messages of love, light, and power. Let this clarify. Okay. Message of love, light, power, spirit. What should my beautiful Scorpio collective know? Okay, the, the first thing we have is message. Uh, family, I feel like we'll be getting a message soon. The message, uh, spirit says this is a divine message from source, your ancestors. I feel like your ancestors right now uh, want to communicate with you more than ever. It's the energy of um, of needing to keep you up to date or needing to keep you aware of some things that you are about to start experiencing and your ancestors want to uh, kind of really break it down to you in their own personal experiences messages of love by and power yeah i feel like your ancestors they want to they want to inform you on how to summon a type of uh, power within yourself that is going to be needed moving forward. It's like a, a energy of uh, having to awaken something within you so that you could bring it forth because it's something that the world needs at this time. Spirit wants you to really get stable in uh, in this new you, this new powerful, abundant uh magical you and i feel like it's like they're getting you prepared for what you are about to embark on your your ancestors your spirit guides are sending you messages in every aspect uh to give you it's like a heads up on what's coming and what is about to be unleashed within you it's like um it's levels to you. It's different lives that you live and spirit is about to unlock certain files in your memory so that it could bring out this very being that maybe you have not encountered in this lifetime before. It's like multiple lifetimes coming together with this, having this wisdom of multiple lives. And it's like Spirit says, it's so that you can walk boldly and in confidence moving forward. Because as this world is shifting, Spirit says the very, the the strength that you've had in past lives are now coming to this one life form, which is your right now, the body form you have now. All of the wisdom, all of the knowledge, all of the memories. It's because this shift is so grand that spirit says that all of your wisdom has to come forth at this time so that it, you you can present you in this confident energy to the world and so that things can start to change by your hand spirit says just about to make you more bold and more wise and more uh in your power where can't nobody tell you shit basically scorpio that's what spirit is saying and also i feel like uh at this time uh the people around you spirit says it, 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 it's so that you can decipher who is loyal and who isn't because you will see it within yourself. And if you come into counsel with somebody that doesn't possess your energy, you will know it's false immediately. And you will be confident in the decision that you make, depending, uh, uh, pertaining to people. Messages of power, messages of power. Okay, the next card we got out is the arts. Mm the arts family i f i can't stress this enough uh a lot of you uh, for a lot of you scorpio spirit is saying it's something creative about you 
that is uh, going to shape the new world in the way that it is supposed to, in the way, in the direction in which it is going of peace and harmony and healing. Spirit says, somebody, especially musically, anybody that is talented musically, uh, vocally, Spirit says, it is time to really expand that. It is time to complete something that you have once begun or or an imagination uh that you have thought it's time to bring those thoughts into into awareness right now at this particular time in life it's like Scorpios, in all aspects of life, you are blessed. In all aspects of life, you shall excel. In all gifts, you shall operate in your gifts. Spirit is calling you to bring out the creation of art within you. Some of you guys are artists. Even me, I I started painting more. Like, just because it has to come out. It's something about what you are bringing forth at this particular time. This time is like no other. Spirit says, I'm giving you visions and dreams so that you can put down is something that has to be summoned within you that must come out messages of power messages of power we have atlantis now when i think of atlantis i think of the the hidden world atlantis under the sea something so deep and that for you and it reminds me of us scorpio we are so deep in depth spirit says whatever it is that is being summoned, that spirit is giving you messages on, is something deep within you that a lot of people won't be able to understand. Think about how deep the 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 uh, the Atlantic Ocean, or think about how deep the ocean is. Like there are there are uh, creatures that are down there that they look different because it's so far down. And that w when when a creature is found that that went so that can go so deep it's like they're they look different you know they have certain certain fish animals that stay uh like they can't go as deep as others and spirit says there's something that's being summoned that that has been left at the bottom that that is not frequently seen that has not been exposed that spirit says is now awakening in you and with this awakening, bringing something that is so rare to come to the top. Spirit says you are going to bring that very rare energy to the forefront, to the light, so that it could be exposed and so that people can see what truly lies beneath. And I feel like this Atlantis is it's hidden wisdom, hidden knowledge, hidden jewels. Something that the world needs to benefit from. And it took, Spirit says, it took you to awaken it in you to bring it out. It was something that only you can go to the depths to get within yourself. And then we have right here where it says confidence. We got food and hunger. So what this makes me feel is that Spirit said right now, I am... I am bringing out something so powerful in you that no one has ever seen before because it was so deep buried within you that only you had to have the courage. You had to, you had to go past the fear of drowning within yourself and you had to bring out something so precious, so beautiful that only you can create because the world is going hungry. And only you can feed them what is coming up. A man cannot live off of bread and water alone. But of the spirit is something within you that has to feed the world so that it can survive. Or so that it could, so that it could survive on a new level, on a new understanding. With new knowledge. Well, old knowledge, but which is new to the to the old world. So, basically, spirit is saying that the new world that is coming in has to be equipped with hidden with the hidden knowledge, the sacred knowledge, 
that very few possess and the, and they don't even have the gist of what is still available that only you can bring out. Mm, that shit deep. That's like, you know how they be saying like, you know, uh, occultic uh, wisdom, knowledge uh, with the secret societies, how they keep all of this uh, wisdom so that the elite can arise. Family, we are the elite. Spirit says the wisdom that they are uh, entwining in, diving into, it says there's wisdom within you that they don't have access to. See, for a lot of us, we were not able to be taught from different groups. Some we were picked, but maybe we didn't choose to be a part of it. I don't know what, what your situation is, but the truth is, no wisdom, some things cannot be taught. And because you have searched, it's because of you, you wanting more, you knowing that there is greater because of your persistence to search something far more greater than what the outside world was telling you. This hidden sacred knowledge is coming from within you, coming from you from within. And because you're seeking it, it is revealing itself to you. You have not because you ask not. You found because you have not seeked. And Spirit says, because you are one of the few that truly want to know the essence of being, existing, existence, you're being gifted with this knowledge. People have died, have sacrificed. People are still doing things to receive this knowledge, which brings about wealth and all the other material things. But Spirit says, but the wisdom that is being revealed to you it can't be taught it's something that you have to want and you have to dive deep to get it and spirit says whatever it is your spirit guides and your angels are here assisting in you to summon that very thing that is so deep within you why because you have to feed the new world this information you are the master. All right, Scorpios, I love y'all. I love y'all self. Understand we are the gods and there's nothing they could do about it. We have awakened. It's awakened with confidence, persistence, and power. Love.